Now this topic is important from the GS3 mains perspective in the space section. Now you can say that hominin species is a mixture or a group of human and human-like apes. The aim of the Lucy mission is to find insights into the formation of the solar system around 4.5 billion years ago. Let's have a basic differentiation between asteroid, meteor, meteorites, etc. More than 9,800 Jupiter Trojans have been found as of May 2021. Hello everyone, welcome to Topic of the Day. My name is Kritika and in this video we will discuss about NASA's probe to Jupiter that was their Lucy mission. Now this topic is important from the GS3 mains perspective in the space section. In October 2021, NASA launched its first spacecraft to study the Jupiter's asteroids and it was named as the Lucy mission. Let us first briefly discuss what this mission is about. Very interestingly, it was named after an ancient fossil which was around 3.2 million years old. It was a women fossil found in Ethiopia back in 1974. These are several hundred pieces of a fossilized bone representing approximately 40% of the skeleton of a female hominin species which is scientifically named as Australopithecus afrancis. Now you can say that hominin species is a mixture or a group of human and human-like apes. So as per NASA, just as the Lucy fossil provided unique insights into the humanity's evolution, the aim of the Lucy mission is to find insights into the formation of the solar system around 4.5 billion years ago. It will also investigate the group of rocky bodies that are circling the sun in two swarms, one preceding the Jupiter and other trailing behind it. Now here we are talking about the Jupiter asteroids, that is the asteroids in the same orbit as Jupiter. The Lucy spacecraft which was built by Lockheed Martin. Now Lockheed Martin is a famous manufacturer in the defense and space sector. Will take a 12 year long journey of 8 different asteroids including one in the main belt between Mars and Jupiter and 7 other Trojans. Now as these Trojan asteroids are formed from the same material as that of planet, this mission is really significant as it will give us insight in the origins and evolution of our solar system. Now let's talk about asteroids. What are asteroids? These are the rocky objects revolving around the sun that are too small to be called planets. Let's have a basic differentiation between asteroid, meteor, meteorites, etc. As we have already discussed, the asteroid is relatively small body that is not a comet. It can be usually rocky or metallic, composed of dirt or even ice. If we talk about meteoroids, these are small asteroids. And when this meteoroid enters the Earth's surface and streaks through the sky, which is also called the shooting star, it is known as a meteor. When this meteoroid hits the ground, it is known as meteorite. So this was a basic differentiation between the terminology. If we talk about the classification based on their orbits, as you can see in the picture, there is a main asteroid belt between Mars and the Jupiter. Then there are two group of asteroids which follow the same orbit as Jupiter, which are called as Trojan asteroids. Now this term Trojan comes from Greek mythology. More than 9,800 Jupiter Trojans have been found as of May 2021. The Trojan asteroids orbit a larger planet in two special places known as the Lagrange points where the gravitational pull of Sun and the planet are balanced. Also, NASA reports the presence of Neptune, Mars and Earth Trojans as well. Then there is another term known as Near-Earth Asteroids. Now these asteroids circle closer to the Earth than the Sun. So this was all for today's topic. You can leave your thoughts in the comment section below. For regular updates, you can follow us on our social media handles. And for more such videos, do stay tuned to the next IAS YouTube channel.